Pro Wrestling Magic presents Championship Wrestling from Richfield Park. Tonight's feature, Billy Dixon versus Jay George. All right, there's the gong. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a fantastic match for you this evening. Jay George taking on Billy Dixon. And look at this, and Billy right away starting to hit him with the elbow. Pointing the elbow right to the top of Jay George's head, and he is out on his feet. Oh my goodness, another elbow. And that might be it for Jay George early on, and... <laughs> <laughs> Billy having a laugh at Jay George's expense goes for the big elbow. And of course, Jay George wants nothing of it. Oh, this Jay George looking for the camera, calling cut. This is the type of behavior that we could come to expect from Jay George. And Jay George looking for another take. And what does he send in his production assistant? in the ring and this guy looks like a bag of rocks in the head has no idea what to do and he's right back out jay george looks to capitalize oh my goodness walks into a brick wall and then gets thrown right back out oh, oh my goodness look at this jay george is beside himself he doesn't know what to do as he's looking, was he's looking for some sort of weaponry, perhaps under the ring? And let us see, he throws the production system, uses him as a distraction, and capitalizes. And look at this viciousness of the strikes of Jay George and as they go back and forth here. It has turned into a pier six brawl. My goodness. J. George has some sort of wire in his hand, of course. This is a, a, a film production theme street fight. A live cinematic match, if you will. Get that pain! Get that pain! As he continues to direct his transmission of pain right into the camera. And look at this one, is he pulling out some crutches here? Why would those ever be under the ring? My goodness. Oh, and a huge shot. And another. And this is just brutality. This is viciousness. This is violence. It's evil. And a kick, look at that. Billy tries to block it, but couldn't block that one. Couldn't get that one either. Yes, and the fans are all about it here. But of course, J. George is not happy and continues to direct, this time directing the audience. And look at that, he's doing it. He's listening for too much time. Too much time. And admonishing the fan for not letting them know that Billy Dixon was on his, but that's on Jay George for turning his back on Billy Dixon. And a kick now for turning the favor. That's it, Jay George getting the what for? What's he looking to do here? Is he looking to direct the. Of course, Billy. And he, he's no stranger to filmmaking, and he's no stranger to getting punched in the face either. As J. George unleashes a flurry of unmitigated violence and just throwing everything at him. Again, the theme for tonight in this match is violence as we, J. George, goes up the patented pro wrestling magic. Uh, the ramp and look at this slipping on the red carpet his own red carpet for the red carpet premiere and look at this rolling up like a rillo i can't believe it i cannot believe it this is this is a sham g george g george is completely wrapped up we might need to get some wire cutters out here to free j george as he gets drop kick into a violent crash on the floor my Goodness. Uh, and look at this again throwing Lenny, the production assistant, like a bag of rocks. And J. George is still, is still wrapped up. Is still wrapped up in his own red carpet. How symbolic is this? How violent is J. George is preventing the chair from being taken? And he gets hit with the chair. He gets hit with the chair. He gets hit with the chair. My goodness. My goodness. 
Um, J. George looking, looking here. No, he's fighting. He's fighting. He's not letting himself get put in no position. He sits the chair. The chair just falls. And J. George looking to escape. And just launches it. He just throws the chair. It's, oh! Uh oh. What is J. George planning here? And folks, that is called the C stand, and that is being driven. The carbon fiber metal is being driven into the eye socket of Billy Dixon. And look at that, J. George is a madman possessed. Oh my goodness. Oh, you can hear that. Yes. And look at the little sugar because of the Latin flavor at the Richfield Park Knights of Columbus. We could feel that one all the way from here. And Billy, look at this. Billy, though. Billy doesn't give up. Billy knows that if you get knocked down, you get back in. And look at those Mongolian chops against the flesh of J. George. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. And a violent, violent crash on the, on the apron. Do you know what the apron is? I don't have to tell you, but I'll say it for those that are unaware that the apron is the hardest part of the ring. Oh my goodness, what is going on? Watch out for what? Grab, grab his foot. J. George once again directing traffic and now using that chair and using that chair very wisely and again setting it up here. And that's what these matches are all about. And this is what J. George is all about. He is all about setting it up. And look at St. George has an actual film reel. Film reel as he drives his head right against the head of another one. Again, those pitbull like headbutts. And look at this, St. George now wrapping the film, wrapping the film up against the eyes, the face of Billy Dixon. Oh, Billy, look at Billy fighting back though. However, Billy fights back, and another kick by J. George. Another. Just pure, violent oh. kicks. Oh, look at this. Billy catching it. What's Billy going to do here? Sends him off. Bam! Catches him into a huge spy buster. One, two. J. George kicks out. J. George kicks out. And a huge knee. A huge knee right to the side, to the temple. And I think Billy might be out, but that's not enough. J. George is, what's he up to? He, he wants to figure out different ways that he can punish him. He wants to figure out different ways he can humiliate. He wants to figure out different ways that he can bring out some inner self for Billy. Billy Dixon as he sets up the chair and these two men here. Is this a good shot? You got it? You can get in the ring if you want it. Oh, look at that Billy. Uh, Billy set up you know, here for... I really like, I really like your performance, you know, but hey, hey, quiet on the side. I'm, I'll kick you out. This arrogant son of a... Oh, and a smack hey, to the listen face. Up. Listen up, huh? And look at these two training flows back and forth, 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 back and forth. Back and forth. Oh my goodness. I have never, never, no. Never seen anything like this before in two. And that's it. Oh my, no. I thought that was it. I thought that was it. A spinal crash of J. George. The, the contusion he must be feeling at this moment. His back destroyed that chair. And, uh, and now Billy is attacking him from the front. A punch right to the face. And I think J. George is out there. Goes for the elbow, but J. George moves out just in time. And what the? Wait, where the, what the? Where did he get that from? Is that a? And look at that. As he's trying to. Oh, as he's trying to find a target right there as he's driving it looks to be a spike a spike to the head of billy a billy a spike to the head it looks to be a regulation spike at that and an elbow a nasty elbow and that's it billy is done for wait a minute billy able to switch the momentum there and a kick and a kick and a kick this is back and forth, drag him out, brawl, a street fight, a pure, 
wait a minute, what the hell? And this guy, what's he doing? Billy is being suffocated now by this bag of rocks. This idiot doesn't know what to do. J. George now giving the proper directions. And now J. George is not happy with that. Again, directing, directing. It's not even directing traffic. It is directing a human life. This is bigger, bigger than traffic. It's bigger than wrestling. He is directed. Oh my goodness, no. That's, oh my, that is using your surroundings. If I've ever seen it, if I've ever seen it, if I've ever seen it, this man has been, everything that's around the ring has been used in some point. And this is, what is he doing? As that's enough. The chair is not enough. The fans having a laugh, at, and Jay George now setting up a chair here, trying to set up a chair. Those ropes are tight. That is a steel cable wrapped in an elevator shell. The the the, the shell that they use for elevator cable. It's an elevator cable, okay? That's what the ropes are. And what is he doing now? Oh my! Oh no! No 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 no! No, 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 Billy says no, Billy says no, Billy says no, and oh, you know where that went, you know where that went, you know where that went, my goodness, Billy sets him up here for something big, Billy moving it along, a bit of an airplane spin action here, setting him up, here we go, oh my god, he just dropped him. He just dropped him. There was nothing left. There was just nothing left but to drop him. Billy knows what he wants. He's got a cheese grater. He's got a cheese grater. Wait, what's he doing? What is the little shuffle, shuffle, shuffle? One, two, and oh my god, how? How do you kick out of that? And J. George saving himself from the greats, the greats of that cheese grater for cutting up his beautiful face. And Billy, though, is messing it up now. Something fears. And wait a minute, a huge cutter, a huge cutter, a huge cutter. If it wasn't the grater that cut him, it was that. And oh my God, at the last possible second, that idiot. Dumbass, Lenny, the production assistant, makes the save for J. George. And now two men try to pick up, try to pick up the Mastodon. Billy Dixon, and Billy reverses it, ducks the clothesline. Here we go, and oh my god, a two-for-one special spear! A two-for-one special spear! And now Billy has to get that just little bit that he has in him, that's left in him, that little bit of fight to come back and overcome the animal that is J. George. And now he's got this idiot savant, complete goofball, and picks him up and he just drops him like you know it, a bag of rocks, but wait a minute, you took too much time, Billy. You took too much time worrying about a worthless human being when the superstar is in that ring right now, about to finish Billy off with his own maneuver, and no, Billy knows it. It's his move, it's his move. Billy and a kick to the, a, oh my God. A kick to the, and a little bit of, again, I out to the face. Nothing little about that. And there's the jump. One, and here we go. Take two lined up. And that is it, folks. I am sorry, but I am positive. And yes, J. George picks up what has to be a huge victory as he heads into his World Heavyweight Championship match. Ladies and gentlemen, J. George with a huge victory here tonight.